With everything going on in the world, we need to make sure we're also praying for our nation. It's a critical time to pray for the United States. That means it's a critical time to pray for Arizona. This is Jennifer LeClaire. This is the Prayer Warriors podcast, and we're pressing into 50 weeks of concentrated prayer, one state each week. This week, we're praying for Arizona. Today's broadcast is brought to you by AwakeningPrayerHubs.com. Join the 5050 campaign. It's free to register or go deeper with us and plant a hub in your city. You can do it virtually. You can do it in person. You can do it in a park. We just want you to pray. Check it out. We'll equip you and train you and you'll be part of a prayer family in dozens and dozens and dozens of nations around the world. Go today to awakeningprayerhubs.com. Join the movement. Known prophetically as the greenhouse state, Arizona has seen an economic boom in recent years. But there's also significant challenges. The Grand Canyon State is also a political hotspot, finding itself in the epicenter of the Republican Party challenges in the 2020 midterm elections. From water issues and its hot and dry desert climate to labor spats and the lucrative chip industry and even rising mental health challenges, Arizona needs our prayers. This week, Awakening Prayer Hubs is praying for Arizona. Remember, you can sign up to get on the Zoom calls at awakeningprayerhubs.com slash 5050. So how do we pray for Arizona? Well, there are certain issues that we're going to pray the same thing for every state, right? Righteous rulership, things of that nature. But there's different issues in different states. And so we do need to enter into identification or repentance over the state of Arizona for idolatry, sexual immorality. There's a lot of battles that were fought on the land. We need to intercede for the southern border of Arizona, for exposure of drug and human trafficking rings, and all uh, that are involved in that will be brought to justice. We need to pray for the harvest of migrants crossing the border, that they would repent unto salvation, and pray for the gospel to run swiftly through Arizona. We need to decree angels would encamp around the state because of the remnant that fears the Lord there. I mean, there's a, a serious issue there in Arizona. We need to pray the church in Arizona would have eyes to see and ears to hear and that the prophetic water levels would rise and the remnant would know its authority as kings and priests in Christ Jesus. Arizona is a critical state in these next elections, I'm telling you. We need to decree waters would burst forth in the wilderness and streams in the desert. Pray, of course, for righteous rulership and decree justice and righteousness will be the foundation in Arizona. We need to pray uh, regarding abortion because Arizona allows legal abortion up to 15 weeks. So we want to pray for a total ban on abortion. We want to pray for exposure and uprooting of any terror cells there. And it just goes on and on. There's so much to pray for educational reform, the remnant rising, healing and restoration for families. You can get all these prayer points at awakeningprayerhubs.com slash global prayer room. There's prayer points for all sorts of things. Each month at Awakening Prayers, we have a, a main theme. And we also ask you to pray for your city and your nation. Now, if you're looking in from the outside and just joining this campaign, we're blessed that you would join with us. But you can go deeper with us, get into the training, get into the community, get into the family of intercessors around the world. It's quite something when we have our family meetings and see people from Uganda and the Netherlands and Australia, all over the world. We are planting hubs virtually, physically. You can join us. God qualifies you. We equip you. So go to awakeningprayerhubs.com slash 5050 if you just want to be part of this campaign. But while you're there, check it out. There's a free ebook there for you. Download it. Get on our email list. We really want to bring you into our prayer family, whether you're looking in from the outside or you're joining forces officially. We love you. We care about you and we bless you. Go to awakeningprayerhubs.com. Join the movement.